What's up, everyone? Welcome to What's in Your Bag. I'm your host, Melissa New, with my co-host here, Mr. Chase Reynolds Hi. of Lens Rentals. How are you? I'm doing great. Good. Doing great. Let's just talk as if Mr. Joe McNally is not sitting right next Do? to us. Please, carry on. <laughs> really, I'll just, I can go to sleep standing up. Good. So this is early energy. in the morning. It is. Are you bringing your feisty this early in the morning? We'll see, Melissa. It depends on how good you are. Oh, okay. So, well, yes. game face on. <laughs> we want to talk about gear. Joe, I want to know, you've, you've messed with a lot of gear, you've played from everything from film cameras to digital to large format, medium format. What is your go-to camera? It's the camera of the moment, you know. Okay. I mean, we're on this digital curve, right? And so I had D4s, mm -hmm. you know, recently, for instance. I could have gone to my grave with a D4. Terrific camera. I've been a Nikon shooter, uh, you know, just as an FYI. I've been a Nikon shooter my whole career. I bought my first Nikon camera in 1973, which Whoa. seriously dates me. You are and, dating yourself. Yeah, here. back in the Should we edit so, that? No, you can, you can, you can, you know, I'm a dinosaur. I'm, I'm, I'm making a happy way to the elephant graveyard. And that's okay for me. You know, I'm totally comfortable with it. Um, but, you know, D4 is an amazingly adept camera, right? Mm -hmm. And I would have been fine with that for the rest of my life. But now the D4S came along, and there's a couple of wrinkles in there that are going to help me. So I dumped my D4s and I bought D4Ss. Uh, group area autofocus, for instance, is a crucial, I think, sort of wrinkle or innovation that's come along. And I feel as a professional photographer, you owe it to your client to be shooting with the best gear you can bring to bear. So I update. I'm not emotionally attached to my gear. I have certain things that are important to me, obviously, that are go-to kinds of bits and pieces, but I'm not emotional about the gear. I don't like hang on to my old cameras. As soon as I'm done with them, I sell them. Really? Because that's the economics of it. I'm gonna buy a new $6,000 camera. I'm gonna try to get two or $3,000 for my old one so I can defray the cost of that. It's an ongoing process. Well, Joe, tell us where we can find your work. For people who have not seen Joe's work, I would definitely check it out. What is your website? Uh, www.midnighttatler.com. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> I You're knew from it. Vegas. I knew <laughs> it. Something. You uh, never know if you're serious. You just uh, never know. I'm just... M-I-D... I'm going to I'm going to go with the obvious here. Yeah, JoeMcNally.com. I write a blog, JoeMcNally.com backslash blog. Uh, we have... In, ter in terms of gear, there's a, 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 you know, a hot link on my blog, uh, Joe's Camera Bag. Just click on that. Nice. Basically everything that we use or are current with, that's right there on those pages. Excellent. And it, definitely check out his work, but I am a big fan of his writing. And it's interesting to find out that you were going to be a writing major, or that's what you studied. So he has such a brilliant way of writing, has such a good way of teaching, and really puts things into um, good perspective and really something that I can relate with. So thank you for all that you put into your, your work and your writing. And we talked a lot about gear, D800, D810, lots of lenses. I definitely check out the folks over at Lens Rentals. Chase is a great guy. His team is working hard. You know, you don't have to buy all these things. Not everyone has the Joe McNally budget, but definitely check out lensrentals.com and, and try out some of these gear. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you. No thank sarcastic you. remarks to, to close out? No, I just it's just been swell to see you again, it's Melissa. It's been so <laughs> swell, Joe.